Yeah. Fill the room with the juice. That's a lot of loot. Uh, that bit fire. Uh, yeah, she kinda cute. Uh, yeah, she wanna slice. I got Chuck E. Cheese. Tats on my chest. Yeah, they on my sleeves. Fill the room with the juice. That's a lot of loot. Yo, ay, yo, ay, ay, yo, ay, 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 put on to the concert and watch pit that real my teeth, yo. <laughs> I done done it again, bro. Know what I'm saying? I got y'all boys with another banger, bro. This is crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Look, now look. You seen? You seen the? Look, man. You seen the title? Know what I'm saying? You feel me? You see? You seen the title, bro? Now look, man, I got y'all boys a dribble tutorial, and look, you seen the, the intro at the beginning, you feel me, like, I can do a little something, you know what I'm saying, but like, really, this video is for people that want to dribble just to get open, you feel me, like, you can, this video is not just to dribble, to just dribble, not, you know what I'm saying, not score, this is for my people that want to dribble to get open, so, I'm not even gonna waste y'all boys time, man, we finna get straight to um, the cigs and stuff like that, so yeah. Now look, man, here are the cigs, you feel me, um, dribble style quick, alright, uh, you see the size ups now. Look, honestly, man, just copy down the six. Know what I'm saying, bro? Cause um, you can probably click. Well, you can probably mm, nah, but no, I'm bro, just use my six, bro. You feel me? Cause like, bro, I'm telling you, bro. If you want, look, man. If you want to get wide open, you feel me? Look, bro. I'm telling you, use my six, bro. Right? If you want to get wide open every time to score, use my six. Know what I'm saying? Cause yeah, honestly, some of the stuff I'm I'm showing y'all in this video. Um, you're gonna need some of my six for some of the moves. So yeah, I would just use my six. You feel me? Cause they're actually. I'm telling you, buddy, these cigs are crazy, all right? Um, now, yeah, as you can see, we got Scotty Pimmer behind the back. Pretty much everybody uses that. Um, basic spin. You know what I'm saying? I got a good move for that. I'm not going to lie. I got a crazy move that's going to get y'all open with that spin. So, put on basic spin, you feel me? And, um, yeah, we got uh, Rondo hesitations, move hesitations. And, um, yeah, I'm not going to lie. I'm talking over this clip. So, I'm just <laughs> I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? You feel me? Hurry up and get this... Uh, Pretty much just get this uh, clip over with, bro. But yeah, you see, move a step back, Jimmy Butler. Uh, and then the, right, the last two don't matter, bro. All right. Now look, man, we finna get straight to it. Now look, man, as y'all boys can see, you know what I'm saying? We got we got the controller in the top left corner. You feel me? <laughs> look, man, I know it's not the best, bro. But I, look, I tried to find something, bro. All right. It's either this or look. As long as I'm explaining it, you, you guys should pretty much know what I'm know what I, I'm talking about, bro. All right. Now look. Basically, bro, um, the first move, you, as you can see on the screen, we're getting to is the momentum, bro. Now, look, if you want to know, look, if you want to know how to do the momentum at this point, bro, it's, bro, we're playing, bro. We are in 2K22, bro. If you want to know how to do the momentum, bro, that's tough. Bro. I'm gonna just show y'all boys either way, man. All right, basically, all you want to do, bro, if the ball is in your right hand, you feel me? All you want to do is flick your right stick up diagonally. Look, you want to hold R2, flick your right stick up diagonally, um, towards the left, and flick your left stick up the same way, diagonally towards the left, diagonally up towards the left. All right. Gosh, I cannot say that. But yeah, um, and if the ball's in your left hand, you feel me? All you want to do is pretty much the same thing. Hold R2 and flick your right stick um up diagonally towards the right and flick your left stick up diagonally towards the right as well. And you should get the momentum crossover, bro. Alright, I hope I explained that right, but we're gonna get to this next move, bro. Alright, man. Now this next move, you feel me? I don't really like to call it like a like a left right, but like if I had to explain it, it's pretty much like a through the legs crossover. Um, look, it's that move right there, as you can see on the screen. Now, I actually do this. I've done this move a lot in the park. Like, I really do it a lot. It's really a great, effective move if you want to get wide open. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty much going to teach y'all boys how to do it. So, basically, all you want to do, bruh, if the ball is in your right hand, you pretty much want to flick uh, your right stick down to put it through your right leg, or your left leg, I guess. And then, um, flick your left stick towards the left. You know what I'm saying? And then, once you do that, you should, like, cross over. And once you cross over, you pretty much hold R2, and you get, like, a little speed boost out of it, bruh. Now, if the ball's in your left hand, bruh, pretty much do it the same way, just the other direction. So, it's like you flick your right stick down towards the um right. Yeah, right stick down towards the right, and then flick your left stick towards the left. And when you get that little crossover, uh, you doing a whole R2 to speed boost out of it, bro. And that's pretty much how you do the move, you know what I'm saying, bro? We finna get to the next one. Now, look, man, I'm not even really finna explain this move, bruh, because it's probably the easiest move out of all of them. Bro, Liddy, all you're doing, bro, is you Liddy, bro, whatever direction you're running, bro, you're just flicking your right stick down, bro. Liddy, just flicking, flicking it down, bro. Flicking it down, bro. Flick your right stick down, holding R2. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be running, though, like left to right. And you just flick it down, man. It's Liddy that simple, man. It's like the little moving step back or whatever I showed y'all in the, um, from the six or whatever. But yeah, we finna get to the next move. 
All right, man. Now this next move is pretty much it's pretty easy too, man. Know what I'm saying I'm not gonna um even like if it's an easy move, I'm not gonna put that little arrows on the controller or whatever. Look, man. Pretty much all you wanna do for this move is if the ball is in your right hand, you pretty much wanna um hold R2 and flick your right stick up um towards the top left, so diagonally left or whatever. And if the ball is in your um left hand, you pretty much wanna hold R2 and flick your right stick up towards the top right. And you pretty much should just get this little move right here. You see how much space you get? Big greens. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? What? Yeah, we about to get to the next move, man. All right, man. Now, this next move is pretty much a behind. Look, man. This is the move I was trying to, um, telling y'all about earlier. Like, when I was showing y'all the six or whatever in the video, bro. Um, basically, it's pretty much with the basic spin move. So, you're pretty much just doing a behind the back. And you're pretty much doing that spin into, like, a little, almost like a hesitation or something. As you can see right there. But, look, man. Pretty much all you want to do, man, is pretty much, look, if you don't, alright, so if you, if the ball is in your left hand, you just do it behind the back, you know what I'm saying, and then you pretty much want to rotate your right stick um, counterclockwise, so like, um, around towards the left, I guess, or the right, I think, I'm, I hope I'm saying that right, but yeah, something like that, and then if the ball's in your right hand, bruh, and you're doing, you know what I'm saying, you pretty much, just, you know, do it behind the back, and then rotate it the other way, so around but the left i can't really i'm not sure how to explain it but yeah man pretty much like that and then once you do that once you get the little spin move out of it whatever um you just want to uh press l2 and you should get a hesitation and then like you know the little step back or whatever and once you get that you, you'll be wide open back. so yeah hey my fault y'all if i didn't explain that last move that really good that good because it's kind of hard to explain but it's it's not that hard you pretty much just doing a behind the back and spin now look man as you can see in this next move uh you feel me this is pretty much just a size up um speed boost so basically all you want to do for this is pretty much hold r2 flick your right stick up to do the size up and once pretty much all you want to do is man once you see the little like the size up like all right so pretty much once you see like the size up where like he he's almost about to like switch the ball to his other hand that's kind of where you just want to like cancel out of it so pretty much you just run and then yeah you should like speed boost out of it and this will give you a lot of space too you know what i'm saying if you try to get wide open yeah, that's pretty much it for that move. It's really not that hard, bro. Um, so yeah, we finna get to the next move. Oh all right, man. Now this next move, you know what I'm saying, bro? Pretty much all my people that play 16 will probably know this. Um, this move right here. You feel me? This is pretty much um the Jamal Crawford behind the back from 16, bro. But yeah, basically, all you want to do is, you know what I'm saying, but to do this, man. You pretty much look, man. Um, hold on. There's, I'm trying to see. I want y'all to see the move real quick. All right, there's a move right there, bro. Yeah, look, if the balls, you know what I'm saying, in your right hand, all you want to do is pretty much just flick your right stick on, you know what I'm saying, uh, di uh, diagonally down towards the left, and then flick it again um, when it's in your left hand, diagonally down towards the right, so you can get it. Um, but if you want to just get it, like, off one try, you know what I'm saying, without having to do it twice, um, pretty much all you want to do is, bro, there's, there's, like, a couple ways you can do it. So you can do a momentum out of it, you know what I'm saying, bro, which is pretty much just... Do the momentum and then flick your right stick diagonally down towards the left. Or you can pretty much just do like, I don't know, like some like, you know, the crossover I showed you guys earlier or whatever. And yeah, you can pretty much do that into it, bro. And like, there's a lot of ways to do it, bro. But I would just say do the momentum out of it if you want to do it once. But yeah, that's pretty much it for that move, man. You know what I'm saying? Alright, man. Look, man. That will be the end of this video. You feel me? Um... I know it wasn't that much. It was a little, you know what I'm saying? Something slight, you feel me? Look, man, y'all boys make sure y'all like and sub, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, Because I got more bangers coming on the way, you feel me? But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's your boy, Green, and I'm out.